Hamtech, welcome back to my DJI Neo learning videos. I have seen this post on Facebook which tells me that in the near future the DJI Neo will work with the goggles Integra and the goggles 2. Now this is a leaked piece of information so please do not take my word for it. But when the Neo was released it did work with the DJ, with the goggles 3. You can see, let's have a look now, goggles 3, there they are. These are nearly £600. They've now made the goggles N3, which I think is a fantastic idea. It halves the price and makes it a lot more affordable to get you know, into the FPV. You do need to use these with the motion controller. And I have a feeling you can use it with the FP FPV controller as well. If you look here, it actually clearly says it. DJI FPV Remote Controller 3 for the DJI Avata Neo O3 Air and so on. And so that's confirmed. So if we look at the Facebook listing, and I'll link it in the description, it says here, DJI O4 Pro and the O4 Lite are compatible with the Goggles 2 and Integra. Then, in the near future, Neo will be able to connect with the DJI G2, short for Goggles 2, and Integra, please wait for the earliest date in the future. Neo can connect with G2 and, and Goggles Integra. This is excellent news because many people that have purchased the Neo already had the Goggles 2, including myself, but I went out in the end and purchased the Goggles 3. I probably wouldn't have done that if I'd known this, but it doesn't matter because I've got them now and then they are excellent. There's also talk of the of race mode on the goggles 3 it says here dual antenna 33 dbm max rf output latency as low as 15 milliseconds when used with goggles 3 in race mode 30 milliseconds latency on the g2 goggles 2 and integra i think they're all using the o4 mode if you look here on the left if i select that You've got exactly the same information that's leaked on Facebook. And this link is on Reddit and it says DJI has announced that the O4 Pro and Goggles 3 will get a race mode with a fixed latency of 15, 15 milliseconds. For me, if they are going to integrate the Goggles Integra and the Goggles 2, which I had for a while, I did actually prefer them to the Integra. I, I preferred the fact that the battery was separate, basically, and the way that the eyes adjusted. But anyway, you've got the links in the description. You tell me, give me some more information. Am I wrong? Is the DJI Neo going to work with those goggles? Otherwise, go out, spend $229 pounds and get yourself the, the uh, goggles N3 for the FPV experience. The annoying thing is you're also going to have to buy the motion controller, which I know many have already got, but when you add that together, then the £449 for the combo, the Fly More Combo Goggles combo, is actually good value because you're getting uh, the motion controller, you're getting the, gogg the goggles, you know, the new goggles N3, the, the drone and three batteries and a charger. For 449 I think that's actually quite good. Thanks for watching my channel. Remember, I'm new. I'm not one of these um, experts on drones brand new but i'm you know I'm, I'm really enjoying it i've got the avata 2 the air 3s the o4 pro o3 pro and uh, the neo and loving every minute of it it's a great hobby bye for now all the best thanks for watching my channel please hit the like and subscribe